So not only has he learned the social awkwardness and, and a new thing, but he's learned a lot about the Mexican side of the border over the years he's been there and immigration. And his family's kind of stay out of our country while you're coming over here. But Coop has learned a lot of people don't have a choice since the North American Free Trade Agreement. And he's seen all these things on the border. So it's a complex character. I mean, he has no filter and says what he's thinking, which is always fun. I love that. But he's a real cop. He's a detective, you know, and he knows his job. And he's the, he's the information guy a lot of times. So it's great for them to have the balls, FX, to have a guy as a mustache and a mini mullet to be the information guy, you know, and be a detective. That's a lot of fun. Well, we've heard that a lot of the police investigation actually takes place over in Mexico and Juarez. This yeah, season. this season, yeah. So, you know, and for me to say the show is better, I'm saying a lot, because it's a little less for me. But, as a, you know, but I'm still in most of the episodes, but it's a better show and it's a more realistic show. If my character doesn't need to be in the show, he shouldn't be there. If he wouldn't be in that episode, he shouldn't be there. The writers know what they're doing and it's such an honor to be a part of this world. You have to trust them and just put on your boots and go to work when you're called. It's a ton of fun. Well, one of the controversial things that came up at the end of the season last season yeah. was the fact that Marco decided he wanted to kill David Tate. Ooh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's edgy. Yeah, I mean, he was put in a spot, you know, and uh, yeah, I mean, you'll, you'll see what happens. You know, Marco is a complex character on his own, you know. When we meet in the pilot, it's kind of Buenos Dias and Howdy Partner. It goes a long way. It's come a long way since then, maybe. Uh, he's complex, and, and, you know, we'll see. He's, he's up against it, and he's got a moral decision to make that's very difficult. And uh, I, think, uh, I think he does pretty well. I yeah. think that the audience is going to be happy with his character. Uh, it's a roller coaster yeah. ride for Jamie, and it's a fresh, fertile valley to play. He's having a great time. I have a great time being on stream with him. Anytime I can be in a scene with him, I just hold on and have fun. <laughs> well, are you getting a chance to work more with um, the Sony character, Marco? Yeah, Perry? yeah. This episode, yeah, we're shooting 11 now. Yeah, I've been fortunate several scenes this season to have some good ones coming up. Yeah, I mean, her and Coop, you know, at the end of last, beginning of last season, they, they butted heads, then she trusted him with a girl that reminded her of her sister, and, you know, and then eventually she's going to have to ask Coop for a favor. Oh. And uh, I think she will, and uh, it'll be interesting to see what Coop does. So. <laughs> Not going to react. Okay, well, we'll look forward to seeing what's going on Thank there.